Birthday's coming up. Yeah, I know. Thinking maybe we could do something. Call you when supper's ready. I was excited when I, right after I read it. I was excited about the script. I, uh, I had a meeting with Michael the next day, and I was excited to, to meet this guy. And, uh, and I'm excited about playing fathers and, and this next, you know, I've aged into another bracket, and I'm, I'm excited about that. Terry's lost a lot, you know. He had a as I see it, he had a terrible relationship with his father, and he has a terrible relation, relationship with his son. So he's sort of just an island unto himself. Terry, to a certain extent, is defined by his regret and his loss. And uh, what I'm trying to do the entire, during the entire story, the, the, our entire time together, is I'm, I'm trying to recapture something that was lost with my son. It's almost like a reversal, like sons, I, I mean, I know I did, trying to, uh, trying to get the father to, to pay attention to them, to love them, to, you know, in this case, it's the father trying to get the son to, uh, to love him, to respect him. The past is, it's like another character in the film. In the case of Terry, the father, he, uh, he regrets a drinking problem that he had. Most of what what occurred in the past is a mystery to him, you know, since he spent most of it in a, in a violent blackout. Um, he was abusive to his wife, abusive to his kid, um, and he's uh, he's gotten sober and and he's awake now, and he is trying to to clean clean up the wreckage of his past as best he can. And you don't think I know, but I know what a piece of shit I was back then. I do. And I can't explain to you how sorry I am for the things that I did to you. And to your mother. But I gotta start living my life. I. But I, I need my son back to do that. 